PSA response rates and additional 20 MCRPC patients enrolled at Peter McCallum Cancer Center higher than previously reported for first group of 30 patients company to host and webcast investor event featuring physician panel on 177 Lou PSMA 617 West Lafayette, Indiana, May 16, 2018, Globe Newswire, and Decide, Inc. NASDAQ ECYT, a biopharmaceutical company developing targeted therapeutics for personalized cancer treatment, today announced that a poster with data from the Peter McCallum Cancer Center will be presented on Endocytes Lead Investigational Therapy at the 2018 ASCO Annual Meeting on Saturday, June 2, 2018. Updated data from the Phase 2 study of 177 Mu PSMA 617 is a potential treatment for metastatic castration-resistant prostate cancer MCRPC, including data from an additional 20-patient expansion cohort will be highlighted by the poster. We are very pleased that we continue to see high rates of PSA response, even in heavily pre-treated patients, said Mike Sherman, President and CEO of Endocyte. In the 50 patients receiving 177 Lu PSMA 617, 62% had a greater than 50% reduction in their PSA levels. Further, 44% of patients had a PSA reduction of 80% or greater. We look forward to sharing more information on this Phase 2 trial at ASCO. We recently reported median overall survival of 13.5 months for the first cohort of 30 patients enrolled. The median overall survival in the total 50 patients is not yet meaningful as follow-up in the second cohort of 20 patients is between 6 and 9 months at the time of cutoff. Updated survival metrics will be presented at a future medical conference as that data matures. ASCO presentation details. Extract. Went, Saturday, June 2, 2018 at 1.15 p.m. to 4.45 p.m. CDT session title, Genitorinary, Prostate, Cancer Location, Hall A Webcast Investor Event and 177 Lu PSMA 617 Panel Discussion. The company will host a reception and webcast panel discussing 177 Lu PSMA 617 for investors and analysts on Monday, June 4, 2018 from 6 p.m. to 8 o'clock p.m. CDT panelists scheduled to participate at the event include Allison Armour, MBCH. B, BSC, MSC, MD, FRCP, FRCR, Chief Medical Officer, and Decide Johannes de Bono, MD, MSC, PH. D, FRCP, Regius Professor of Cancer Research Professor, the Royal Marsden NHS Foundation Trust, UK, Oliver Sartor, MD, C. The webcast will be archived shortly after the live event, and a replay will be available on the company's website for at least 90 days following the event. Website information, Endocyte routinely posts important information intended for investors on its website, www.endocyte.com, in the Investors. Endocide uses this website as a means of disclosing material information in legal compliance with its disclosure obligations under Regulation FD. Accordingly, investors should monitor the investors. Press releases, SEC filings, public conference calls, presentations and webcasts, the information contained on, or that may be accessed through, the Endocide website is not incorporated by reference into, and is not a part of, this document. About Endocyte, Endocyte is a biopharmaceutical company and leader in developing targeted therapies for the personalized treatment of cancer. The company's drug conjugation technology targets therapeutics and companion imaging agents specifically to the site of diseased cells. 
Endocytes lead clinical program is an experimental prostate-specific membrane antigen, PSMA, targeted radiolicant therapy, 177 mu PSMA 617, entering phase 3 for metastatic castration-resistant prostate cancer, MCRPC. Endocyte also expects to have an investigational new drug application submitted in the fourth quarter of 2018 for its adapter-controlled CAR T-cell therapy which will be studied initially in osteosarcoma. For additional information, please regularly visit Endocyte's website at www.endocyte.com. Forward-looking statements, certain of the statements made in this press release are forward-looking, such as those, among others, relating to the company's future development plans and presentation and status of clinical data. Actual results or developments may differ materially from those projected or implied in these forward-looking statements. Factors that may cause such a difference include risks that the company or independent investigators may experience delays in submission and review of regulatory applications, execution of clinical trials and or the processing of clinical data. More information about the risks and uncertainties faced by Endocyte, Inc. is contained in the company's periodic reports filed with the Securities and Exchange Commission. Endocyte, Inc. Disclaims any intention or obligation to update or revise any forward-looking statements, whether as a result of new information, future events, or otherwise. Investor Contact Stephanie Asher, Stern Investor Relations, Inc. 212-362-1200, Stephanie at Sterner.com